Welcome to First Word Pharma's News Roundup for August 21st, brought to you today by editorial researcher Olivia Roger. In our top news story, Japanese regulators approved AstraZeneca's Tegriso for the first-line treatment of patients with inoperable or recurrent EGFR mutation-positive non-small cell lung cancer. The clearance of Tegriso is based on a study in which the drug demonstrated superior progression-free survival of 18.9 months compared with 10.2 months for standard of care. Also in the news... Sources suggested that GlaxoSmithKline is seeking bids for its Indian Consumer Healthcare Unit by the middle of next month. The people indicated that potential suitors include Nestle and Reckitt Benckiser, with the division expected to fetch more than $4 billion in a sale. In other news, the FDA converted conditional approval of Merck & Co's Keytruda to full clearance in combination with Olympta and chemotherapy for the first-line treatment of patients with metastatic non-squamous non-small cell lung cancer. The regulator noted that approval came under its real-time oncology review pilot, enabling a review team to begin analyzing data from the Keynote 189 trial before a filing was made. And finally, MC2 Therapeutics Experimental Psoriasis Cream MC201 demonstrated significant superiority in a Phase three trial in both treatment success and patient-reported treatment convenience compared to Leo Pharma's Teclonix topical suspension. MC2 Therapeutics indicated that it plans to submit a marketing application for its product with the FDA in the first half of 2019. To read these and other stories in full, please visit firstwordpharma.com. Are you able to keep up with all the news and views in the biosimilars market? First Word's Biosimilar Index is the only dedicated biosimilar and non-comparable biologics intelligence tool available. Get ahead of your competition and learn more today. 